Welcome to the Inside Mac Television program coming to you from Apple's campus in Cupertino, California. Today we have a special event coming to you from the Apple Town Hall. We have a presentation by Steve Jobs. They're going to have some brand new cool things. For more information on Inside Mac TV, go to www.insidemactv.com. Thank you for joining us this morning. We've got some fun things to introduce today. Uh, sort of some medium scale things. Uh, but all of us want every single one of them, so we hope our customers do too. Today, we are introducing a Mac Mini with an Intel Core Solo. This is a single processor Intel chip inside the Mac Mini. So how's the performance stack up against the G4 that we had? Well, if we compare it against the Mac Mini G4 in Intel or in uh, integer spec marks, it's two and a half times faster. In floating point spec marks, it's over three times faster. So two and a half to three times faster in the same size box. But we're also putting a dual processor in there in the same size box, an Intel Core Duo. And now the performance just goes into the stratosphere. Uh, compared to the prior product, basically five times faster on integer spec marks and over five times faster on floating point. One of the other things that we're adding to the Mac Mini is front row. And that means we had to add a remote control. So we've added the IR sensor right in the front next to the disk slot. And of course, we use the same Apple remote. So today, we're introducing the iPod Hi-Fi. And it's a companion product to the iPod. It's really home stereo reinvented. Because what we see is your music is not in CDs in your cabinet anymore. It's on your iPod. And so your stereo is really ready to move to an iPod-based stereo if we could just get the quality up on the rest of the system. And we're doing that today with iPod Hi-Fi. This is iPod Hi-Fi. Take the grill off. It's a three-driver system. This is what it looks like from the top a little bit. And one of the keys is right on the top We've got a place to plug in your iPod. We've got a universal iPod dock built right into the top of it. And we've got these plug-ins for every iPod that has a connector on it that we've ever shipped. Let's take a look inside, though. There's a lot going on in here. The first thing we see, let's take a look at the back. We've integrated not only the electronics, but the power supply right in there. So there's no power brick. It just plugs right into the wall. You get tired of all these power bricks dangling around, especially you know, in your kitchen and places where you see them right out in the open. And you can power this off six D-sized batteries. So if you want to take this out you know, to the cabana or the pool and listen to it out there, you can just pop in six D-cells and go out and listen to it for several hours outside and get great sound wherever you are. Then we've got two 80 millimeter mid-range drivers, and these are in a sealed acoustic suspension. So these are sealed chambers to get the most out of these uh, mid-range drivers. They're actually kind of wide-range drivers that handle from the base all the way up. And now the base system. We've got 130 millimeter dual voice coil woofer, and it is a ported base reflex design. So you can see the ports coming right out the front. We get great bass out of this thing, and it doesn't distort when you crank it up. It's home stereo reinvented for the iPod age. And I got to tell you, this thing is so good. I've been using one for the last month, keeping it, you know, a little cloth over it at home and stuff. <laughs> I'm an audiophile. I've had stereos costing a, well, I won't say, but you think, <laughs> you think I was crazy, but a lot. And, uh, I'm actually getting rid of my stereo uh, that cost a lot to go with these things. They, are, they have phenomenal sound. And I think a lot of our customers are going to have more than one of these around their house. They are really, really good. So thank you very much for coming today. And uh, we'll see you all real soon. Thanks. <laughs>